and with the prime numbers, the fact that they call number two a prime number, mm-hmm. when it's clearly a composite number, any other prime number, and I'll jump into this, any prime number that you subtract from another prime number, you always get a composite number, except with the situation of the number two. And there's so many people that, and that's why the, the prime numbers are unpredictable, because of that problem associated. So there's been a problem with two for so long. Two is different. I mean, you will find that um, mathematicians will often talk about uh, proving something for characteristic not equal to two. So they'll single out two as being just very, very different. So look that up when you when we're done. Yeah, I'm but happy why? To, but why would they do because that? Because in part of what you're saying, the prime two, two, it does belong as a prime, but it is also special. And in other words, I have the opportunity to straw man you. What's with, going on with the number two? I'm the sitting CIA, over here going, the CIA hey, is in charge of the What's up two. with two? Two is different. Because yeah. of what he said, you know, the, right. the fact that the even odd distinction. Isn't that odd, though? That but two is different? The what problem, a strange thing. The problem that associ- that's associated with the number two is because of the identity principle, which I call the Jim Crow laws of mathematics. <sighs> <laughs> that A times one you go, I know you don't it's want to okay. go into it yet. No, no, but no, that, let's get just into as it. a base, just you, as a base. You're going right into his neighborhood. Just as a you're base. You're in the mathematical no hood right now. <laughs> trying to keep a black have, man down. No, you got you 